Hey guys, welcome back. My name is Angel and I am here to do the Aquarius reading. So guys, this is going to be for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. You know cross watchers are always welcome. Alright, what has been going on guys? I have not spoke to you since probably June. I took a little summer vacay. So, um, I hope everybody stayed safe, and uh, I will have a um, new video call coming out called, um, Do You Think You're Psychic? That will uh, premiere Sunday night at 7 o'clock uh, Central Standard Time. So, guys, let's see what the main energies for your reading is. For Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Well, perfect timing. So does perfect timing begin? Upheld right now. Oh, and the situation is a no. So, there's something that, uh, that came about, and it's just not the right time yet. Not the perfect timing uh, for romance. Okay, for Aquarius. We will be using the light seers to clarify. So, you turn this person down, huh? You said hell, it's just not the right time yet. Let's see what this is all about. Alrighty, y'all. So, perfect timing. Clarify perfect timing. Oh, a truth in a situation came out. Truth regarding being held on to. Um, was this person holding on to you the whole time? Maybe this is a reconciliation. Or the truth is that you're holding on to someone else. Let's see. No. Three of Cups with the Three of Pentacles. You believe that this person is happy somewhere else, um, building somewhere else, wherever they are, okay? And you, you believe that they're happy where they're at. They need to fundamentally build wherever they are. Um, you believe that there is a shot for y'all, okay, and maybe in the future, but it's just not, that is the truth, that you'll always hold on to this person, okay? That is the God's honest truth. You'll, they'll always have um, a place in your heart, okay, saved up in a little cubby hole up in there. But, um, let's see, clarify romance. You find this person dear to you, um, something you don't want to let go of, something uh, genuine. Romance. The chariot and the star. So you, um, you want to move this forward and heal. Heal the situation between y'all. Um, But I think the the main um, there's been some disappointments in your past, and that's not that's why you're not together. Um, I think that you will never let this person go. Um, but the truth is, uh, when you balance the equation, um, this person will always, always. 
no matter what happens, they will always have a special place in your heart. But I think that um, this person needs to be elsewhere right now. And I think that's that's why things are no. Okay, I think that um, they're happy building with the third party. So, uh, you know, it could be that just this person has a family um, and they're happy uh, with their circumstances that they're in presently. You know, it takes a lot of work when you, um, when you're trying to make others happy. Okay. Um, but the romance really, uh, the intimacy between you two, I think movement needs to come to the place where, uh, you actually need to heal. Okay. Let's get Spirit's advice directly from them. For Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Unless you're a cross watcher. Then don't pay attention to advice. No, just kidding. Alright. You may get a little bit too much insight. I'm just joking. All are welcome. What is Spirit's advice for Aquarius? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for this spread. They're being hard-headed with just I think they're running out of advice for you. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> you may feel that way, okay? Y'all may have tried this uh, so many times, you know? But um, because you never let this person go. Spirits of ice. Have the strength. Oh, don't be fearful. Don't be afraid. And you need to trust God. Okay. No matter what. It says the grace and inner strength needed to overcome challenges. The power of kindness <clears throat> and forgiveness. Time to embrace how wonderful you are. Um, my advice. Let go and let God. This person's actually busy. You know, they're, they're, they're busy with others. Um, y'all need some time to heal anyway. And they're asking you right now to have the strength to do so. Have the strength, you know. If you need to dress up in your old wedding dress and look beautiful as I'll be and, and look, this man wants to marry me and I feel that joyous and proud and high priestess type of energy. Well, then that's what you need to feel right now. But don't make it like you have to give yourself away. Give that energy away to anybody, but give it to you. So go have, go have yourself some nail time. Bring your little, uh, your little ear, uh, buds and, um, I know it's hard to meditate at the nail salon, but, um, you know, because you're being pushed and proddered and all of that. But um, maybe you want to go for a massage. That would be nice. All right, guys. I love y'all, Aquarius. And namaste. I will see y'all in September. Namaste.